little bit ago I posted a couple of videos about the TLR7 and its failure. So this is a completely new light stream light. Replaced my old light completely. I just sent them back my old one and <clears throat> we're hoping that this one will work. Uh, they said they test fired it. However, all I got was like blue markings on the rail part, uh, which I sent a picture to the service department manager and I'm not sure what that was like their idea of test firing it uh, maybe one of the service minions maybe one of the service minions just put it on a blue gun and that was their idea of a test uh, but I thought they were going to test fire it there was zero residue on it so we're gonna see we're gonna see where this thing fails because I've got 250 rounds of 40 caliber ammunition on the Breda 96A1 same gun that always, this thing was always mounted to for the most part uh, except for like some props, but I'm gonna go ahead and quickly test this not waste your time But we're gonna see how this thing does so let's go ahead and get to it So it doesn't look like this thing really moved at all so I just turned it off there's a reference point for the red band and Let's see It hasn't moved at all. So There's nothing in there. There's no thread lock or anything so we're going to go ahead and load it up. We'll do it again. In the interest of brevity, I'm just going to go ahead and shoot this. I'll be on camera, but I'll speed it up. And then we'll go ahead and see if there's an issue. Obviously, if there's an issue, we'll go back to normal speed. And we'll discuss it and check it out. So far, I'm not seeing any movement on this. So, let's go ahead and see how it does. This is not quite, it was supposed to be stopping apparently right there. So this part was supposed to stop right there. So it lasted a good amount. All I cared about was if it was working. So it's rotating itself off. And that was about, I, I don't even know how many rounds, but oh my goodness, that's actually a good amount of turns. So this is it fully on right here. So let me go ahead and, I got about this much left. So about 100 rounds. 50 to 100 rounds left, so, so yeah, I did actually shoot a pretty good amount, but let me go ahead and load this up and see if we can track any movement. So just as a reference point, looks like right there, right at the center line. So this thing is fully on, ah, and that barrel is hot, duh, but right at that center line, that is it fully on. So right in line with that little pick rail right there. So let me go ahead and load up the rest of this and see if it turns off again all right so it's in line and here we go so it started to move and yeah so let's look at this so it's off center here and yeah so if you remember these two pieces were basically let's just start turning this notice where these are just right about there nice and equally spaced so it started its turn now it's not a moving as aggressively as it was last time but it did turn itself off after what <coughs> Uh, probably about a hundred rounds, so I don't know. I, I guess you guys can be the judge if the TLR7 has redeemed itself or not. I'm gonna let the I'm gonna let Streamlight know and ask them if that's normal. But yeah, that uh, this is what happened. So saw it for yourself, and uh, I guess we'll go ahead and. Uh, See what we can do about that, but yeah, just another part of the TLR7 adventure. But yeah, this bread at 96A1, it's sweet to shoot. Love that little little bit of kick that it gives, but you know you're shooting a real gun. But 
anyways, thanks a lot for watching, and you guys have a good one.